Hi, I'm Achungai Kamai. Um, I'm here in Jemai tribe of uh, Jelengrung community. And this village is known as um, Yangkolen village. And, uh, and today I'm going to show you uh, a village which is known for preserving rich cultures and traditional heritage. Uh, they are also have um, a rich flora and fauna and the people are still maintaining the traditional ways of lifestyle. This village is surrounded by stone. And the road here itself is made of stone. This is considered as one of the biggest gate among the, I mean, among the four gate, this is the biggest. And we call it Riandiki, Riandiki. This is a Lonzam beach, mm -hmm. and we have a nine days of celebrations. That one particular day, only men folk can play this. Mm -hmm. And after that, uh, actually, we are not allowed to enter here. And women are restricted to touch even these stepping stones. There are particular days which uh, men folk they used to have a kind of competition through this Lonzam. Mm -hmm. Okay. This is the village water pond and this water pond is known as Tazaiku and here in this water pond areas uh, the women are very restricted. The women are not even allowed to sit here or even allowed to touch the water and if it happens mistakenly uh, the whole villages will stop work for one day and uh, these are the cultural and traditional heritage that has been uh, carried on since generation. These uh, stones are something like uh, memory. Eh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is the Hatman house and uh, here all the villages uh, meetings and all the decision makers it is held here. And these are the symbols of the head hunter. And uh, here in this place, women or ladies are not allowed. This Jemai community of Chelengrong community, uh, they are the only community which is uh, which preserve uh, uh, the old ways. Even though now we are living in a modern society, I'm here in Jemai Yangkolen villages and I'm reporting for India Unheard.